Welcome back to Tome 1. Getting close to wrapping everything up here. Well, let's go ahead and see what the hell they're on about. Okay. <laughs> Shoveling out of way, huh? Get you. I'm not gonna get used to that speed. <laughs> so we're gonna look for a broken vase. Oh, look, there it is. How you would have had to put two and fish together to figure out that was a thing? No idea. I mean, it makes sense to me. You're not able to leave the village. Where else are you supposed to go? Go through the exit tunnel. What is the tunnel? The tunnel that he escaped. <coughs> oh, there. <laughs> All right, you chuckleheads. Here you go. Stop it. Oh, oh well, shit. Uh, the elder's just like, I have manifested here. A sinkhole in the middle of the village? <laughs> I just casually walk away. I mean, it's whatever. There we go. The Grisky. Mm-hmm. <laughs> All right. Well, I know where he's at. Right there. Mm-mm. Yeah, it's not there. He never made it because you covered up the hole. <laughs> what the malarkey is that shit? <laughs> Did you just die in there? Mm -mm. Is he back in his little hole? <laughs> I mean, if you want something shiny, I must have overlooked it. Oh, can't help you, man. Okay. What's that? So this is kind of an arbitrary one that needs to get done um, before we can do the race with him. Huh. But uh, you gotta go to the watchtower. Like the actual tower. I don't work. Okay. I 
mean, they have these ridiculously fast pants, so. <laughs> Yeet! <laughs> That's why you have to have a little compensate. <laughs> Okay, so apparently you have to go onto the roof. Look and see. And then use it in the watchtower. Wee, wee, sir. <laughs> Island. All right, where to yeah. from here? Now you can go back to the front door of the watchtower, and he'll be there. My goodness, you have thirty-two lives. All the better to lose them with, right? <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, so the next one that should be ready is ready, set, go. Maybe you gotta talk to him first? Or do I have to find him? He might still be at the, uh, the thing. The thing, the thing, the thing, the thing? His prison. Alright, well, first things first, I am right here. Yes. into the sky. Oh. Finally found, you found me, I bit through hell. Um. <coughs> that is a good question. Okay. Leaf mm. <laughs> I'm so hungry. Here. That's this golden fruit. Oh. <laughs> Have this lunch box. Some cheese! I don't know why they keep giving me cheese, but I'm not in the mood for complaining. Hidden Butterfly Village. Yeah. <laughs> ah. That's the spooky. Got it. Sorry I couldn't go up there. Mm-hmm. Although this still 
pretty much spells doom for me. Mm-hmm. That's those crazy pants of yours. There you go. Remember, you can take that hole in the bottom to go... Oh, I could. But... There's some fun in that. There's a gold chest over here. Oh, yeah, he's... Back. <laughs> I'm lifted aloft <laughs> in the sky. Oh, wait, I already grabbed that. Hmm. Mm -hmm. You might want to heal yourself. No, where's the fun in that? <laughs> you didn't clear that yet? I just found I did. I guess I didn't. Hmm. Ow! <laughs> Ow. Tell me how that was smart. You said it had to be smart. <laughs> All right. Right, to the dwarf village. Uh -huh. <coughs> Aw, hi, Baron. We. It's so cute. I thought you might like him. He's so cute. <laughs> ah, thief! <laughs> Go to jail. No, sir. Go. Okay, that works. Is the jewel of wind. You are an outpatch for my funky red pants! So you specifically needed to climb to there? Okay. Aww. Silver powder. Alright, well, let's get that witch candy. Byron! <laughs> so what do they mean by In order to collect the jewels The experience bar must be maxed out For the specific element? 
Okay, I know what they're talking about. Oh. That's what that is. Every time you jump on a thing, that bar at the bottom is a certain element. Mm -hmm. And this one's already maxed out. But that's so weird. A lot of your stuff has ten at the bottom. No, no, no. Only one. Right, so, then... so, where's your info? Okay, you're we have to put it in a specific order. Duh. Just... I'll put any other stuff in first. Uh. So what's your elemental stats? Give me a second. Oh. Magic mirror? What'd that do? So now you have a grapple. Oh, the grapple jack! Nice. Sweet! I was waiting for the grapple jack to be made. My first little favorite tool. I didn't even know you could make the grapple jack. Yeah, you didn't really get uh this far. <laughs> <laughs> I am unstoppable. You're a loony. You're the loony. Alright, now you wanted to see my stats? Yeah. Oh, see? Two of them are maxed out, so you should be able to get two of the gems, right? Mm-hmm. Weird. But I don't know which gems those are. I know. Well, hold on, maybe. I don't know where the blue one comes from. Uh, the blue <laughs> one... <laughs> So you're only missing the blue experience, right? Yep. Uh, let's see, best way to... Way to help maximize it is the fighting the needle gators. Where are on top of the mountain? Got mm hmm. Not nearly as fun. Nope. <laughs> but I mean, this is kind of um, last, uh, last fight kind of elemental 
attacks. Jewel of Fire! Yep. So that's where the red one was, but I don't remember where the green one is? So... You don't have the blue one yet. The green one... Is in Phoenix Mountain by the Phoenix Nest. Alright, well, oh. we gotta go there anyways. Why is that? Because the. Uh, gotta deal with the needle getters. Sure. Where are you going? Just checking. Ooh, there Ta -da! it is. You get a double jump. What? You get a double jump. How would I want that? <laughs> it's <seems> dangerous. <laughs> Uh, yeah. The jewel allows Tomba to perform a double jump by pressing the jump button mid-air. It's also useful when crossing larger gaps or areas if the funky parasol is also equipped. Oh shit. Just realized trash chests galore in here. Big <laughs> Live. Peggy. <laughs> Live. There you are. I think I just killed him. <laughs> no! Sad for me! Also bad for me. Also not good for me. Piss off you. I said uh, piss off. Uh, I uh, said uh, piss the great googly moogly off. Oh yes, float. <laughs> oh, you have to equip them. Got it. Ah, dick. Nobody likes a dingleberry like you. Um, hmm. So when activated, the jewel surrounds Tomba with a large flame that defeats regular enemies in one hit. If Tomba falls into water, the jewel... Uh, when the jewel is equipped, he will take damage even if he has obtained the ability to swim. That's actually a fair trade. But you cannot use a weapon. That's not so much a fair trade. You're just walking around as fire. Well, check that out of that. Ooh, that's nice, actually. Wait, I need to not travel. So I'm trying to go kill these needle gears. I need to punish them for existing. You know, I wonder. How That's an wonderable. Your health bar. How to get that to actually read that it's got more. Mm-hmm. <laughs> 
When a new game is created, Tumbo will have four units of health in both games. This will take a bit, but... See, that's in the second game. I don't want that. I want the first game. Did the thing, um, ye yeet you essentially? More or less. A little time consuming, but hey. <laughs> <coughs> <coughs> You did have one of the guys fall, but he didn't technically count. Maybe we could do this off camera. <laughs> I was thinking the same thing, but anyways, it's time for us to end it anyways. Oh. Mm -hmm. I like this game. <laughs> That's fine. I'm sure there'll be quite a few people who enjoy this game too. Just gonna show them this part. Anyway, thanks for tuning in, everybody. I hope you enjoy your evening. Bye bye.